Hello friends. Welcome to SourceCat Tutorials. Today I will make a simple spur gear profile in 2D and 3D AutoCAD 2013. I will start with drafting and annotation workspace. First of all, I will make two construction lines vertical and horizontal. Next, I'll make all the required intermediate circles. First, we'll make a circle with radius 0.25. circle with radius 0.25 then 0.5 then 1 finally we will make a circle each circle with radius 1.5 now I will offset horizontal construction line at the distance of 0 0.1309 units again I'll offset middle construction lines horizontal one at the distance of 0 0.047 units next I will offset vertical construction line at the distance of 0 0.107 units on both sides now make a offset of this pitch circle at the distance of 0 0.1905 on both sides offset Now we have all the anchor points for making a gear profile, a gear tooth completed. All we have to do is trim all the unwanted lines and circles. So we will use trim command. I'll delete all lines which are not required we'll perform same trim operation on horizontal construction lines Now use polar array to array this is a small segment of arc. About center and we'll use 18 instances of that arc. Let's explode this one so that other operations can be performed on it
now use three point arc tool and join these three points use it again we have our teeth completed now delete every line which is not required <coughs> join all these three arcs into a single polyline I'll use polar array once again to array this polyline about center again I'll use 18 instances and explode Our gear profile is almost ready. All we have to do is just fill it out all these sharp edges. But before that, I will join all separate polylines. use fillet command and a radius of 0 0.062 use multiple and fillet every sharp corner point this is a little bit time taking process you can do this method otherwise also by making array of uh, all the four arcs that we have made previously added out everything here next we will change our workspace to convert this into a 3d model we have selected 3d modeling workspace I will use press pull tool for performing 3D task. Select the bounded region. And give it a depth of minus 0.5 I will again select 
that region and give it a height of 0.5 the profile is not clearly visible so I'll use shaded view now our profile is quite visible clearly here next use press pull tool again select this bounded region and again press pull 0.5 and 0.5 in positive direction next we have this region left press pull it minus 0.25 and plus 0.25 we have our profile almost ready all we have to do is just fill it out all the sharp edges before filleting I'll union complete body now go to solid and use fillet edge I'll fillet all the edges with the radius of 0.125 units radius 0.125 units I'll turn it backwards and perform same operation here press enter and again we have our 3D is per gear profile complete in 3D workspace of AutoCAD. So that's all for today's class. We'll see another video in next week. Thank you guys for being with me.